Good day, friends. Paul here. And like you, I am very annoyed by high-pitched frequency sounds, and tracking them down can be challenging. But if you're on Android, check out the Spectroid app. That's what I've got here on my phone. And I tracked down the culprit of this high-frequency pitch noise, which is this laptop charger. You can see here that frequency is closer to 5,000 hertz. So you can see how that could be slightly irritating just because of us sheltering in place. Like people are more aware of protecting their environment, protecting ourselves from, well, anything right now, but including um, EMF, electric magnetic frequency, radiation, radio waves. Uh, 5G, people have concerns about 5G, and rightly so. Actually, I just got a uh, a nice Wi-Fi router with 5G, and I have to admit, I, I love the speed on my laptop. But this is a good way to troubleshoot these annoying high-pitch frequency sounds. Let your ears do the work, of course. Go around, turn off stuff, isolate stuff, unplug stuff. That's a great way to tell. And also as a very handy tool, check out the Spectroid app. I've done a couple videos on this, and uh, you can use it as far as documenting noisy neighbors as well, and problems in that area around the neighborhood, dogs, noisy neighbors, things like that, where you can actually have a record of the decibel range and the frequency. I found it very useful to have this app, and it just troubleshooted this... Uh, power adapter, which I just bought cheap off eBay. Well, you get what you pay for, right? I mean, it powers up my laptop, but I have to admit that that noise is a little bit irritating. I do appreciate you guys being around here, particularly during this time that we're in, as I've noticed a huge bump in my views uh, recently. And I think it's great that we are connecting online more than ever, and that it's actually a tool for us the internet has become more of a utilitarian tool and not just so much the typical crap that we see all over YouTube and, you know, the cult of personality kind of stuff. Now, you know, we're sharing information. We're sharing information and ideas and commentary in the comment section of all these platforms, especially YouTube for me and for many of you who love the medium. Thanks for tuning in. Good luck getting rid of and I identifying and getting rid of those high, annoying high pitch frequency sounds. Post your comments below if you need any tips on how to troubleshoot further. Be well. Have a good day, friends.